man, get this started. I know what people right now, they probably say, yo, get to the video, 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 but you know what I mean? God damn. Woman. Who, who are you talking to like that? You know I mean, to, you, you got to talk to them black women like that. No, you don't. God damn. God no, damn. You don't. Damn Democrats. <laughs> <laughs> See, he they gonna ass. be mad at that one. What you mean, Democrat? So us black women, we gotta just be Democrat. <laughs> about to get killed in the yeah. comments. Well, we gonna get murdered in these y'all. Boy. Yeah, watch your mouth. Watch oh your man. Mouth. So first, first video, first video. We got we got a suspended police chief in Atlanta admits to not wanting to hire minority female police officers. <sighs> I am so intrigued. I want to know why. <laughs> yes. <laughs> T. Hmm? Don't you want to know why? I want to hear it. Okay. Then, then let's I want to hear why she got suspended. I mean, was it that deep? Let's see what, we'll just see what they got to say. All right, let's go. Shit, peanut. Peanut. It's this Jump Podcast. Oh. Let's go. A black female police chief has now been suspended for not wanting to hire other black female officers. The now suspended police chief at the Atlanta VA Medical Center once said in a staff meeting that she no longer wanted to hire black or Hispanic female officers because they, quote, come with a whole lot of attitude. I am to the point, I don't want to hire black women no more. I'm to that point. I don't have no Hispanic women. Hell, I don't want them me. Cause you know what comes with it? A whole lot of f***ing attitude, and I don't want it. An Atlanta black female police chief has now been suspended indefinitely for being caught on a recording, claiming she doesn't want to hire other black female officers. The statements from the Atlanta police chief has garnered controversy online. Commenters claimed that she's not wrong about the attitudes, and that she shouldn't be fired for telling the truth. But what do you think about the situation? Do you think that the Atlanta police chief should be fired from her job? Comment your opinion in the comment section down below. <laughs> Man. He said, I'm saying these happens. <laughs> Look, they these do happens. be having attitudes. But at the end of the day, she sound like she had one too. Did she? She sound like <laughs> she had one too. <laughs> I, listen, I, I want to know. You know what? I think somebody recorded her. Yeah, I believe that that was during a meeting, and somebody recorded her and put that shit on. Yeah, but did they author? Were they authorized to record? No. So why was she, see? That's the thing. Like, and and, and we we not gonna go on a whole tangent with this. So if they were not authorized to record, how are they even authorized to suspend her for her speaking or saying her her opinion on something that should not have been recorded in the first place? Did she give her consent? Because it got out into the public. You know that public perception. Okay, make her do some kind of sensitivity sensitivity training. She said she don't want to hire y'all heifers. Y'all heifers. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, <laughs> Geraldine said, I'm tired of Sharkeisha now. Coming in here with all these damn weeds and attitudes. I, listen, we try to lock people up. <laughs> Y'all in here, if you don't want to go lock people up, go work at Subway or something. She said, I'm tired of this. Now, she had her own attitude, so she did. Then she, maybe they, they clash, but she said, I, I, uh-uh, you could get uh, Selena and them too. I don't want them either. She has no picks. <laughs> listen, Geraldine, Yvette uh, Johnson, she said she's tired of it. She's cleaning it up. <laughs> She said, I she don't want the Spanish. Too. I don't want she don't want none nobody. Of them. None of them. Yeah, that's that's discrimination. She can't do that. I mean, <laughs> well, you know what? Hold on. I mean, T, you know, it, is it hard to work with black yeah. women? Yeah, is it? Is it? Is it? Um, It's so, hard to work with women in general. For real? Yes. Women all together? With women. All minorities? Women, yes. You do. Come on now, let it out. Even the Caucasian <laughs> ones? Let, let, yeah, let, they, they, let they, they added to this too. Okay. They what? added to this too. Yes, they are. Yes, they are. I work with them all. So and I so let's let's just let's just make it clear. Okay. Yes, the black women, they carry it on their shoulders. They carry it out in the open all day, every day. Now what? other cultures, yes, they're a little bit more sensitive to it. Sometimes they have their days and their moments. But at the end of the day, you'll tell one person, okay, all right, Tamika, I need you to, uh, you know, give me that report. What? I'm about to go to lunch. <laughs> okay. Can I'm, you just email it to me right quick? I mean, do you need I'm it now? On my break. <laughs> like, I mean, the, the the happy hour over at Parkside got 50 then, cent wings that's over in about 13 minutes. Can I just get back to you? Look, then I got Lisa on the other hand. 
Oh yeah, sure. Let me get that over to you right quick. But so so wait a minute. So now is it more of the Caucasian persuasion? Are they more of the passive aggressive type attitude? Um or or, I or am I stereotyping? I in a sense because they're not too far behind the yeah. African Americans. The ones that I would say that never give me a problem are more so like of the Asian Islanders. What? Right? Yeah. They I never had no problems with them. Ain't that something. Yeah, y'all hear that? that is she never Asian give him problem from the Asian island. Yeah. Get you an Asian woman. <laughs> that's what she's basically saying. That's what, that's okay. what she's saying, goddamn. That is not what I'm saying. <laughs> no, 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 no. That's what we're telling you, man. <laughs> okay. That's what you said tonight. <laughs> uh, let's go to the comment. <laughs> so, first comment is from King Henry. King Henry says, it's so damn true. They always come with that attitude that you can't tell them nothing. You can't tell them they're not doing their job correctly or when uh, to, to go on a break. Damn, <laughs> Damn King. Uh, and listen, I think I think he's in management. <laughs> he's well, like he's in management. Well, not to mention, that's another thing with the breaks. African Americans, well, they going on them breaks. Listen. I, 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 they I, I, they I, I, when we on, break, Bernie we break. break. <laughs> they be going for like... <laughs> Hour 45 Shout minutes. out to Uncle Bernie. <laughs> May he Buddha. rest in peace. But when, when they leave, they go to the mall. They hey, come back. Hey. They come back with bags. What I do on my break, <laughs> I don't get paid for this. So I'm going to do what I need to do for myself. Hey, hold on. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> hold on. What, what Bernie say? When we break. We break. We break. Anybody seen Johnny? <laughs> like, 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 listen, if you want to go outside and, and smoke on your break, cool. If I want to go pay my electric bill, that's my business. Okay? <laughs> Look, they can't sit, tell me what to do. They, they sit at their desk and eat their lunch. Right. Oh, <laughs> so no. So that I can go outside. You know, we? Shit. Let me tell you something. It's been many nights I went in my car and slept. Listen. <laughs> on my brain. <laughs> and um, just to let all you employers and you managers, directors, or whatever you know, my break don't start until I get my food. Dang. Okay? <laughs> So I don't care when I ordered it. When I get my food in my hand, that's when break starts. It ain't my fault. <laughs> hey, I can't be working and order it at the same time, so I had to wait. I ordered it. When it get in my hand, break that now. <laughs> yes, it has now. Come wait, wait, so are you saying your break don't end until you finish your food? No. So I got thirty minutes from when I get that food, <laughs> but not when I left that desk. No, no, that's not how that works. So I'm letting y'all know to update your HR policies <laughs> to let you know when the food get in my hand and I pay for it, hit the clock. That's, that's when, when the break starts. Yeah, I'm ready to no, go. So yeah. uh, I want to tell you that's falsification. <laughs> Says who? <laughs> yeah, then we break. Says uh, my HR handbook. Hey, hey. <laughs> update your policy. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, let's go to comment number two, man. So comment number two is from Show Show Two Four Seven. He says, "Not, I'm sorry, I believe that's a, that's a female." She says, "Not all like that, but there are some truth because we experience it every day in the workplace, yes, yes. and makes you cautious as to who you hire. Some have, was it, some have children, childish a childish mindset." mindset can't and you them. can't tell them nothing. Yeah, but you don't know that when somebody's interviewing because at the end of the day, I do interviews all the time and people always putting their best foot forward. Of course. But when, of course. They get, yeah. when they get their foot in the door, then that's when everything comes out. So you never know what you get. It, it, completely different. Totally different. In my experience, because I, I work in corporate America, so I haven't really ran into that. Mine is always in customer service. Why do y'all take these customer service jobs if you don't like people? Oh, right. my God. Oh, yeah, my God. Bro. I just what? found a number, dog. Bro, you got to wait. I can't. Yeah. <laughs> Listen, what? I just came in here to get some brake pads. <laughs> Why is you mad in auto zone? <laughs> Why would you come work here? That's all I need is to get my brake pads and I'm out. Oh, God. What, what size? What, what, what kind of car you got? You know what? I got to give a shout out to Chick-fil-A because I got to say, no matter what Chick-fil-A I have ever been in, oh, they Chick-fil-A have got some hell of a customer service. That's what they the they, best customer service. Yeah, that's a part of their brand. Yeah, Chick-fil-A yes. got some hell of a customer service. That's just shit. You know, and that chicken good. All right, hey, where my chicken, bitch? <laughs> oh, see? <laughs> come on now. <laughs> CJ just said he apologized and he said about the oh, I'm I think sorry. We, I think that word is, I looked it up. I think we... That one. We, we, can, we, we, we can get away with that? Yeah, we can get that oh, one off. Uh, Don't tell him yes, that. Yes, you too. <laughs> 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 All 
Oh man, let's hit comment number three. Let's hit the last comment for this video. Um, this comment is from Dreams Reality. As a black woman that worked around nothing but black females, I totally understand the attitudes, bullying, harassment, plotting, mm -hmm. etc. Don't the blame gossiping. her at all. <laughs> yeah, the gossiping. Oh my gosh. When you have one disgruntled black female. Oh, they try to spread it. She, oh yes. Get out they of here. make it known. And then it just spreads like a, a disease. Oh man. Ugh. Horrible. Makes the whole morale in the office or whatever environment that you're in just bad. Get out of here. You know what? Let me tell you something. I'm, I'm, let me pour a drink for all my all my black women, man. Lord. No, not all y'all like that, goddamn. Yeah, I, I don't, yeah. don't want to yeah. put no, it No, we, we definitely not it. saying everybody's like that, y'all. Again, I used to work in HR, which is very female and very, very Caucasian. And I seen some stuff go down with them. They, 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 they not as, I say, aggressive verbally but they do some backbiting stuff yes, yeah they do you can't trust them yeah they will what? get somebody to write your year-end review a little wrong do a little you know a little uh, brown nosing get your get your <laughs> get your uh, year-end review messed up mess up your bonus